Yeah, Brandon, court wrapped up about 5 o'clock this evening, and shortly after that, we were able to catch this video here of Josh Duggar and his attorneys exiting the building. And as been accustomed with him and his attorneys, they did not answer any questions. But today, as you mentioned, opening arguments, and one attorney told jurors it was going to be similar to solving a mystery. With Josh Duggar's wife in the gallery, the jurors first heard from prosecuting attorney Dustin Roberts. In his 20-minute opening argument, he warned the jurors, made up of six men and six women, that they will see explicit material. He said, quote, you're going to see real children, not actors, some as young as seven. Then defense attorney Justin Gelfin began his opening argument, telling jurors, quote, if you like a good mystery, this case is for you. Over 40 minutes, Gelfin also told jurors how they would prove the download of pornographic images do not connect to Josh Duggar, saying, quote, it's equivalent to the trail of blood from a murder scene that does not lead to Josh Duggar. Then two law enforcement agents took the stand, a Little Rock detective from the Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force who traced the downloaded porn, and Homeland Security agent Gerald Faulkner who conducted the search warrant. He testified today that Josh said to him, Quote, is this about somebody downloading child pornography before he told them the purpose of the search? One trial footnote here, the judge ruled that a testimony regarding years old child molestation involving Josh Duggar will be allowed. Uh, proceedings will pick up tomorrow morning at 8.30 right here with cross-examination by the defense of Special Agent Faulkner. The judge believes that this trial is going to last about five or six days. Again, Josh Duggar is charged with one count of receipt of child pornography, one count of possession. If convicted, he could spend up to 20 years in prison and face fines of up to $250,000 for each charge. We're live in Fayetteville. Paul Petit, 4029 News.